Doctor Who would be B-15, but she is carrying out the will of God of Stories, Loki. So we don't know if Paradox knows that Loki has taken over the organization, or if he's just seeing the TVA from the perspective of middle management, and he just got a memo that said his job changed. But Paradox's resistance tells us how dangerous the TVA really is. It has internal divisions and factions that resist change and covertly are able to use parts of it for their own agendas. Paradox unveils his mercy-killing machine, the Time Ripper, saying once completed it will allow me to destroy the space-time matrix of your universe. Later, when we see the Time Ripper in action, it's inside thing looks like it's composed or at least powered by dozens of reset charge canisters from the Loki series. And remember, each one of those could clean a single branch of the timeline before that branch crossed the threshold at least. So it makes sense that it would take dozens of these powered by columns of matter and antimatter underneath to completely spaghettify an entire trunk of a reality. Deadpool headbutt Paradox and leaps to grab his temp pad, planning to find a Wolverine who can fill that anchor spot. And he nearly sits on the face of that TVA tech, but instead he just opens a time door and takes the guy's mug. But there's something I gotta talk about here. Editors are really the hidden superstars of every YouTube channel. But particularly on New Rockstars, we would not be able to do anything without our editors. And on every video we make here at New Rockstars, our editors use Adobe Premiere Pro to make it look good. Oh, you looking for this? We use Adobe Premiere Pro because no other software we've tried is as customizable, or as powerful, or as intuitive. Premiere Pro lets us import and combine virtually any type of media, from video shop. having to renew his contract. Finally, Deadpool arrives to this Canadian bar where he finds a very, very drunk Wolverine. The shot of Wolverine from behind evokes the shot of Wolverine from the trailer for Insomniac's PS5 game. The bartender is played by Greg Hemphill, a Scottish comedian from shows like Still Game. He tries to get Wolverine to leave because as we'll learn later, this Wolverine turned humanity against the X-Men. After his X-Men got killed, he just continued to wage war on humanity, both the bad humans and the good humans, and really just turned into the biggest asshole of his universe. There are Calgary Flames logos and banners all over this bar, but standing in the background is a cameo by Ollie Palmer, striker for Rex from AFC. On the tip jar is a sign that let's just put the tip in, see how it feels. This Wolverine tries to snake his claws, but they only come out an inch or so, which is